we're out here in Planada, California, in the Central Valley, and we are working with a group of amazing community members and children from the local elementary school here, people of all ages here in the community to create a series of community mural projects um, that feature a lot of different ideas that they have come up with, things that they care about, and a variety of social issues. This project was to be originally in Merced. I invited a friend of mine to go to Fresno to pick up some spray paint. That guy lives here in Planada. He told another guy that's uh, one of the community activists here. We met here at, the, at this baseball field. Told me how interested he is in having something here, how much this city will just embrace it. I go, okay, let's do it. We're very lucky to have our local uh, UC professor, uh, Richard Gomez, and a friend of his, internationally uh, renowned muralist, Joel Artista. We're just going to work, just trying to beautify our community just trying to bring something positive to, to this town. The brainstorming session happened last spring with one of our community liaisons, Alex Garcia, and he had established a relationship with Professor Gomez from UC Merced, who teaches in the Art and Humanities program. And so we started to flush out a concept of uh, creating a community project where we could involve UC Merced, the Planada Parks and Recreation Department, our after school program, and the whole community to try and bring life to these walls. These walls were defaced last summer uh, as we were completing our Junior Giants season and so that kind of inspired the concept of if we bring the community together put some beautiful art on the walls that hopefully the community would own this project that tells its story and a little bit of its history as you will see throughout the murals and uh, hoping to create this as a sanctuary uh, for kids the community and keep our walls free of any type of graffiti or, or defacing. We had this canvas here that seemed to be tagged uh, every so often and so uh, through some of the work from community members, the Parks and Rec, we kind of worked together and getting the whole community involved and uh, getting a world-renowned artist out here to help us out beautify Planada. So since the beginning, since the first workshop, we've had a lot of support from the school district. Um, we've had a lot of support from the community. We have uh, many different people who live around here who have been coming by to work with the kids and work with us and, and create this mural. We have Ruben Sanchez, who's a local artist here in the community, who has come and added some of his artwork on the, on the mural as well. So it's really a collaborative effort and it's really a way for people to connect with each other here. It's been amazing because we've had we had pre-K, pre TK kids out here painting with some of our uh, community uh, historians and so it's just been a nice collaboration of some of our senior members of our community to our youngest members. So nothing but positive. Every time folks drive by we get a lot of compliments and seeing the, uh, the process unfold. I just want to give our, our sincere appreciation to all of the volunteers. This was a two week project on the surface, but it was about six months worth of planning and using multiple resources. And so we just want to thank all the volunteers and a special thank you to Professor Richard Gomez and the artist uh, uh, Joel Bergner, also known as Joel Artista. Thank you.